Throughout all the years I've been in the Accelerators community, which is like one, and all the times I've seen the movies, which is like four, I've accumulated a lot of things I wanted to talk about but don't fit into one single video. So, here are some not easter eggs, <laughs> <coughs> but inconsistencies, oddities, details, you know, just interesting things all in one video. These are no particular order, by the way. The Storm Realm track texture changes really inconsistently for some reason. It switches between Aerolis, World Race, and Regular, sometimes even in the same scenes. Uh, let me show you. I don't think so! Maybe I'll draft with you for a while! It's really strange, especially since the Excel drum is right before and the track doesn't change at all. Maybe the shots were animated out of order and halfway somewhere they just changed their minds? Who knows. A little while ago, I recognized that the drum beat from this drone's theme that plays in the Storm Realm is the same drum beat as Mas Queso from Tenedi Avalanche. But as it turns out, it isn't from Tenady actually. It's just a really common sample called the Amen Break. It's crazy how one sample can be spread across different media. The drone headquarters has a skybox texture that's the same texture from the ignition box art, the ignition website, and the realm champion files. And while we're on the topic of realm champion, the sprite for the portal at the end of the realms is the same image as the wheel of power on the accelerodrome screens. Morning. Oh, it's good to see another wave rip. I'm not driving, Bert. For some reason, the realm symbols and the indents next to it are glowing, which doesn't show up in the actual model. There's this one scene after the storm realm in ignition where Taro is recovering in the infirmary room. And I think the lighting looks weird. It, it looks almost exactly like the renders. I think it's a lighting preset or something? It's even more odd when we go back to the same room and in speed of silence and the lighting is different. The posters are pretty inaccurate sometimes, with the pipeline and ice realm posters having drivers or cars that were never in there in the movies. It could go two ways. Either these were made 
Early introduction, where they haven't decided on which drivers enter yet, or the promotional material isn't following the story, which I think is the most likely. And with that detail, that wraps up this video. I hope you enjoyed this format. Because of the bite size nature, I could definitely do more of these if you guys want. Thanks for watching, and.